All right, we're gonna react to another death battle. This is Eggman versus Willy or Wily. Let's see how this goes. It's no secret that scientists are, well, crazy as hell. But these two take it way too far. Dr. Evo Robotnik, a.k.a. the Eggman. And Dr. Albert Wiley, a.k.a. Einstein without Rogaine. In this <laughs> scenario, both doctors will be using mechanized armies to see who is the deadliest robot commander. He's with and I'm Boomstick. And it's our job to analyze their weapons, armor, and skills to find out who would win a death battle. Uh, hold on a sec. This seems a bit, like... Quiet on my end, so I'm gonna quickly. Yeah, that worked. Is the obese yet strangely athletic evil mastermind responsible for terrorizing the world of Sonic the Hedgehog in his quest to rule a global empire. His engineering mastery has led to a. I have yet to watch the Sonic movies. Using the strangest fuel source, kidnapped animals. He's PETA's worst nightmare. I heard it's some of uh, Jim, Jim uh, Carrey's best work as Dr. Robotnik. His army is I might have to like third party stream it. Including motobugs, caterpillars, buzz bombers, egg ponds, and squat bots. But Eggman's got way more than that. His egg fleet is a huge armada of battleships led by the massive egg carrier, which supports a huge <sighs> front mounted laser cannon. The Eggman army is spearheaded by his deadliest robot warriors, the Badniks. The Egg Robo is a smart bot crafted in Eggman's own image and designed to carry out tasks Eggman himself would normally do. What's this guy's deal with eggs? On its own, Silver Sonic yeah. appears slow and bulky, but it is powered by a Chaos Emerald, making it a much faster and more practical machine. Then he made another Robo Hog, Mecha Sonic, who focuses on firepower over speed. Mecha Sonic can even absorb Chaos Energy to attain a short lived super form. But Eggman wanted more than just Sonic Bots. Mecha Knuckles can glide and vomit giant <laughs> rockets. And E-101 Beta remains one of Eggman's most versatile creations. He's a flying robot with super speed, teleportation, and a reflector shield. He shoots homing missiles and kamehamehas and has one of my favorite defensive abilities ever, the backhand. The Shadow Androids are fast and durable and typically fight in groups of three. However, their design is so complex they sometimes glitch in close combat. And speaking of glitches, despite being an absolute genius, Dr. Eggman appears to suffer from a peculiar personality disorder that sent him through several different phases. Let's uh, just hope that scratch and grounder phase doesn't show up today. But the none what? of Eggman's creations have ever been as deadly or as successful as his ultimate killing machine. Hyper Metal Sonic. Metal Sonic was specifically designed to be better than Sonic the Hedgehog in every way, and was a complete success. Metal can move much faster than Sonic, easily reaching near Mach 5 speeds. Metal's abilities include Sonic's spin dash and homing attack, along with the impenetrable black shield. He's also got a chest laser, rocket-powered flight, and the maximum overdrive attack, where he overloads his circuits to create a glowy energy field that'll burn through pretty much anything. That and can't be good. All. Somehow Eggman managed to make Metal Sonic an ever-evolving force. Metal has the uncanny ability to scan and copy data from others, flawlessly replicating their abilities. Damn, Eggman sure stepped up his game. Obtaining enough power can transform Metal into a number of more impressive forms, all of which increase his abilities immeasurably. The only downside to giving Metal Sonic a super brain is Eggman sometimes has trouble keeping him in line. But As even with his metallic would. minions waging his war, Dr. Eggman is perfectly willing to step into the battlefield himself. He pilots the Eggmobile, a fast single-man pod with twin-mounted machine guns. The Eggmobile's most vital function, however, is its universal compatibility to operate almost all of Eggman's machines. Like the humongous Death Egg robot with its spiked rocket arms and lasers. Eggman is vicious and clever. He's an expert at playing his opponents right into his hands. At the same time, though, he can be overly obsessive to the point of overlooking some important factors in an effort to concentrate on a single goal. But while this can be a perilous game for Eggman, it also makes him dangerously unpredictable. A nice dream, but dreams are meant to be broken. After being continuously outshined by his insensitive colleague, Dr. Light, Dr. Albert W. Wiley turned to a life of crime in an attempt to achieve fame and power. How 
did he plan to get so famous, you ask? By taking over the world. Whether through his own engineering or impressive hacking, over the years, Wiley developed a large, diverse robot army built on the ideals of both solid defense and ranged firepower. Met, Sniper Joes, and Bladers make up the bulk. With hotheads and elephants, oh my! <laughs> Wiley is a mastermind in more than just hardware. His Roboenza virus is a deadly disease for robots, making them unstable and violent with no regard for human life. Okay, so he made it. Weird a disease is definitely for... the yellow devil. A giant pulsating Thanks. yellow blob thing that pulls itself apart and uses its own body as a weapon. Wiley's That's army weird. is led by his robot master. Gutsman was a civil engineering machine remade as a powerhouse who can lift over two tons. Metal Man was made specifically for killing things. You can tell because he's got evil red eyes. He wields yeah, that's like a common trope. Blades, one of the deadliest weapons in video game history. And is made of lightweight material, making him quick-footed. Slash Man is fast and agile and wields the Slash mm. Claw, a portable alien blade that's designed to destroy asteroids. Okay. Magnet Man is a tactical fighter who uses homing magnet missiles and the magnet shield to outmaneuver enemies. And then there's Sheep Man. <laughs> Originally designed to actually herd sheep, he was reprogrammed by Wily to turn into clouds, get bored easily, and fall apart when hit by rubber baseballs. What the Baseball <laughs> Man is a walking weapon. And a robot master after my own heart. He liked blowing shit up so much that he built his own weapons museum. And then blew it up. Pharaoh Man possesses a large arsenal of mysterious powers, including fireballs, energy waves, teleportation, a magic shield, and levitation. And he's also known for being a little punch happy. But Dr. Wily's ultimate robot master is none other than Bass, a direct imitation of his nemesis, Mega Man. He even has a robo dog helper called Trouble. Bass is powered by Basnium, an extremely potent and unique energy source. Base Neum? You just made that up. I wish oh, I did. man. Well, he wields the Base Buster, an arm cannon that has both rapid fire and charge shot settings. He is programmed to be able to copy any action he has seen. If he gets a hold of another's weapon, he can use it to the same effectiveness as the original owner. He can also fuse with trouble using the Super Adapter, creating Super Base. Base is extremely powerful, but fairly <laughs> That just reminds me of that Nicki Minaj song. Crash and arrogance. He seeks to prove he is the strongest robot warrior there is, and will even disobey Dr. Wily's orders if he thinks oh. they have his goal. Though he will not kill his creator, he has occasionally attacked him. That's when Wily busts out his personal fighting vehicle. The Wily machine has gone through several variations. Even a dinosaur. Though Wily's favorite appears to be machine number eight. Good old eight can fly, launch missiles, and has a triple barreled laser cannon and a boomerang buzzsaw. It also houses Wily's personal transportation, the Wily capsule. Which makes the worst sound you've ever heard in your life. Make it stop! Ah. Make it stop! Wily designs and commands his robots with long-term strategy in mind, and as a result, often keeps his team as flexible as possible. Though this means each robot has specific exploitable weaknesses, as a unit, Wily's team is prepared for anything. I will create chaos, destroy everything, and the best part, oh, the very best part is... I have finally hmm. gotten the best of Dr. Life! <laughs> <laughs> all right, the combatants are set. Let's end this debate once and for all. But first, we've got an advertisement from, uh... Actually, Boomstick, we don't need to do those anymore. Really? Absolutely. Freedom! It's time <laughs> for an endless death battle! Yeah! Oh, except for the beginning, unless you're advantage, which really helps us support the show so we can make more things fight each other to the death. Thank you, we love you. <laughs> Ah. Fight. Yep, Attack. just enjoy Attack. the chaos. Well, my five fires is superior. Attack! Ha! <laughs> Haha, your minions are out are outmatched. No matter. Get a load of this. Target confirmed. Robot Masters, go! 
Sweet, where's the sheep guy? Where's the sheep? I want to get the sheep. I want to see the sheep utterly fail. Yep, it's that guy. Oh, there's a sheepy. Sheepy's dead. Oh, there's a chaos from him. Oh yeah, I'm a badass. About time you showed up, base. Wait, what's that green thing? Yep, a chaos crystal. Oh. Good luck, base. Finally, a worthy challenge. Chaos is gonna happen. What the? I oh, got yeah, this cube. No. Get back, blob thing. Call in the egg fleet. This is a disaster. Not so fast, fat cell. <laughs> Giant robot fight. Dr. Wiley, look out! Wait, I have a defeat. Please spare me. No fear and stuff done. I called it! <laughs> Sucker! <laughs> what? It's a dummy! Look who's talking. Dumb robots, why do I always have to do everything myself? A giant pill bomb. Ha! That's robots in. Oh, it's a Not disease. Yet. Behold the almighty egg fleet. <laughs> now it's over. I've won. Uh, nope, that robot disease makes him go crazy. Kneel before your master. <laughs> I feel like this might be what a li loss of both. Oh no, come here, trouble. to a freaking Pokemon. <laughs> yep, they both lost. Well, that world's fucked. Our bad. <laughs> so Technically, Wily won because he used the Roboenza, which ultimately meant the end for Eggman. But then he died too. And that's technically Eggman's robot, so. Then the winner is. Uh. Metal Sonic? Metal Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's really no beating a crazed robot. See you in the next one.